Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Dead Cells. It's been, well, along with the Binding of Isaac, it's been a while since I've recorded this. Uh, I'm a little out of practice, but hopefully we can make a little bit of progress. Uh, put that in my backpack. Rapier, not the greatest weapon in the game. Not my first pick, probably not even my second. Maybe not third. But it allows for crazy schmix ups. Whenever you, the first attack after you dodge is a critical. So it's especially effective against the shield guys. Who are a nightmare to deal with. Critical damage at close range. Okay. Alright. I can see how I could use that. Kebab I don't need. Injector. Really not sure. Toxic sewers, I guess. Just for the cells, right? Okay. So. Uh. I don't know what we're doing. <laughs> I don't remember enough about this game to say, alright, what are we looking for? Uh, victims burn when they die. Covered in burning oil. Generates a toxic cloud. Okay, no, that could be really, really, really good. We'll take that. Yeah, we'll take that. Super good. We didn't get 30 enemies. I don't think we found 30 enemies. Uh, 23. Impaler. Could be good. We'll probably just take that instead of the rapier. And now, we got to start investing in some higher... Some higher, higher priced items. We'll, we'll just start investing in the health flask, because we're going to need that for later. Do that. Hang on. Plus 80% damage to a poisoned target. And our wolf traps drop, or they generate a toxic cloud. So if our... Uh, if our wolf traps generate toxic clouds, and then we use the impaler, that's going to do 80% more damage. And if they're up against the wall, that's going to be a critical hit, which is just crazy damage. But, uh, unfortunately, a lot of things down here are resistant or immune to poison, or so I would imagine. Uh, freezes nearby enemies when we affect them. I mean, there's no downside. Oh, that just takes us out. Okay. Alright, I want to take my time in the, uh, the toxic sewers. I want to fully explore everything. Because there was there was one time. Oh no. There was one time when I found a uh, an alternate route. All right, that's good. So if I, yeah, yeah, might as well. Hang on. Okay. Oh, what? 
Okay, well, I'm not getting the 30 enemy kill streak. Or no, it's 60 because this is the second area. I like the Impaler more than the Rapier, honestly. Oh, no! Oh my god, that does so much damage! Hey! Oh my god! Poisons the enemy. I would gladly take this over the infantry bow, just because the infantry bow isn't very good. Get out of that. Oh, God. Is that our first scroll? Holy crap. Alright, broadsword is slow, but it's freaking good. Look at that, 800 damage. Ramparts, not yet. Because I want to see if I can get this alternate sewer area. Or maybe I can only get it uh, from the first area. can't get through that. I don't have the uh, the wall jump technique. I've gotten there before and I didn't need the wall jumps, so we're gonna hope and pray <laughs> that we can get to it. Ah, oh, crap. probably cut some of this out for you just so that uh, you don't have to watch all the boring lame stuff I don't have any jumping I don't have the wall jump so I can't get up to that but I can get down here ancient sewers here we go okay because I was go I had to go to the ossuary to get the stomp rune to get to this door. And now the ancient sewers is a whole new area to me. Just dump everything into health flask too. Give me... What is it? Armadillo pack. Just so that we have some parry abilities. Okay. I'm expecting to get the wall jump ability in the ancient sewers. I was in here before, like off camera, but I did not uh, get very far. I died almost immediately. Yeah, it was something like this that uh, I died on. Elite? Pretty darn easy. Reveal secret walls. Yeah, no, I'll take that. That sounds really good. Yo, hey, you're new. You're not very cool, but you're new. <laughs> Beating me up like that. Uh, light speed? No. Tentacle? Uh, lore area, four store. Looked solid before it was broken down. 
Keep this door locked at all costs. If the rats get out, they will spread the malice. Rats are always a prime suspect in times of illness. I don't know, I kind of like rats. And I'd be surprised if it was rats that made a hole like that. Uh, I would investigate... Yeah, I would investigate that over there, but that gives me damage. Uh, this one. Survival. Yo, the portals are, like, corrupted here. Like, being swallowed by vines. It's super cool. No! You're such a jerk. Kebab, thank you. Hmm. Okay. Uh, we'll go down. That was a mistake. Item room? Okay. Another impaler. Don't think that's gonna help us though. Not as helpful as the one that we already have, or at least I think. What does that do? Roots nearby enemies. More. Ooh, hang on. Uh. Well, uh. Yeah, here, we'll try it. Just iframe through those grenades. Quote unquote grenades! So while I have armadillo pack. Oh! No, 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 no. Okay, stop. Heal. While I have armadillo pack, uh. I'm actually able to reflect those little bombs. What's this? What did, I've been seeing those all around. I don't know what those are for. there? Where are we going? I'm not leaving without some kind of special upgrade. Or until I full cleared and have not gotten a special upgrade. Oh, the mushrooms make the ground wiggly and then they do the spikes. Not good for me. Old service key. Alright, that's something. Yeah, he makes the ground like red and wiggly. I got another old service key. Okay, let me get out of there. I'm gonna take a drink. Not worth it. <laughs> yeah, it's just a syringe. It's not really worth it. Oh, 
Oh, those were all uh, falling platforms. I'm okay though. It's gotta be down here. No, it's not down here. Recycle that. Really? Uh, maybe I gotta use the service keys to get there? I don't know. I just want my wall jump, dude. Mm -hmm. Okay. So... No! Hold service key. I've got three of these. Got him. Aww. Well, this is certainly different. Secret zone discovered. Definitely come back to that later. Oh, are these for the old service keys? Because I would really like this. And if this is the exit, I'm going back. Insufferable crypt? Uh, it doesn't actually look like there's much more to discover. Because holy crap, that's a really long area. Okay. Yeah. Maybe I am supposed to get it in the insufferable crypt. Went all the way over there, that's all explored. I don't think there's anything down here in the bottom of this maze area, but I'm definitely going to check this out. Leave no stone on turn kind of thing, you know? Ah, oh, crap. Go, I'll go check out that secret area again, too. I'll just cut some of it out so that you guys don't have to suffer. Mm, no, alright, I can't get through that little hole. I've tried hitting everything in that area, so. Guess we have to go to the insufferable crypt. But I do have time and keys to get a couple more things. What would be the most expensive. Probably the blood sword. Now we will take all of this money. Oh crap, that could hit me. On the way down. There we go. And we're going to take all of this money and invest into upgrading our existing gear. We're going to lose our synergies with the poison, but that's okay because we'll have more survivability. Uh, we also have a butt-ton of cells. Is there anything that we can outright buy that might be interesting? That would be really good for the armadillo pack. The ice shield. Let's just, uh, we'll dump it into a health flask. Because that could be extremely important. Oh, upgrade gear. Plus, 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 plus. Okay. Yeah. I'm just happy that we have more, uh, more damage output. Okay. 
Insufferable Crypt. King decided to convert this old crypt to a storehouse after all. Huh? I couldn't read that. You guys can read that. Even the rats avoid this. Oh god! Oh my god! <laughs> this is like terrifying! Oh, I hate you! Oh, stop looking at me! Please! Alright, so I can't do anything about those. Oh, Jesus, you're terrifying! Oh, everything in my body is telling me to stay away from you. I just gotta deal with the, uh, the tentacles? I mean, alright. Honestly, not a bad boss fight right now. I mean, you're terrifying. I would pay to just, like, not have to look at you. Jeez. I think I need ranged items for this. Because I don't see how I can get a whole lot of damage out on him. Uh. Oh, okay. His chains are gone. The tentacles themselves don't do much damage, but if I let them attack me too many times, that damage is going to add up. Oh, and now they're just a lot faster and angrier. Oh, he's got one chain left, okay. Armadillo pack is super good for this battle for me because I do not like using shields in this game All right next next bit of damage I take I am gonna heal a little bit Okay Okay now that bullet hell is over I'm gonna heal we got one heal left gonna charge me? Alright, uh, tentacle time, yeah. Can I root them? Yes. Okay. I'm I'm assuming that this will be the last phase. Oh, we've almost got him. We've almost got him. First try, baby. Oh god. That thing like actually creeped me out the first time I saw him.
Blueprint, uh, tentacle. <laughs> Please be a melee weapon. Uh, not excited about that. Not excited about the, the, the jelly that he left either that's still moving. Slumbering sanctuary, okay. We're exploring. A lot of, lot of new ground that we're covering. I've never been, I've never seen that guy before. Never seen the slumbering sanctuary. Uh, tentacle. <laughs> Melee weapon, yes. Ignore shields and project you towards the enemy. And f uh, inflict a critical hit while you, if you attack again while bumped. Huh? That could be really cool. Uh, I'm going to take a break from the health flask and invest into the tentacle. Because I feel like that'd be super, super funny. The Slumbering Sanctuary. I like the scenery. I like the colors. A lot of blue and orange going on. Big fan, gotta say. I've never been here before. Usually I need the wall jump ability. Oh my gosh. This is like ancient... This gives me like uh, Breath of the Wild vibes. Like ancient ruins, but still somehow like technologically advanced, you know? Fortune and glory key. I can't read the rest of the trophy name. Oh my god. Oh, those guys up there. Oh, they they remind me of the, the clockwork soldiers from Dishonored. Oh, they're absolutely terrifying. I've never experienced anything like these guys before. This is going to be very tough. A lot more of these toxic bats, too. Yeah, that's a lot of health damage. Ah, Jesus. No, stop. Let me heal. Alright. Is this unlocked? No, it's not. Ah, Jesus! How do I take that thing out? I guess my impaler just won't reach it. That won't get through the door either. Do I need a separate ability to get through these doors? This is really, really cool! Curse treasure, absolutely not, not here, no. If I take that, then I will be cursed, which means if I take damage before I kill X amount of enemies, I just instantly die. Which I don't want to, I want to explore this new area. Brutality, definitely. Okay, so those guys I can easily take out by parrying their attacks. Just scroll up here. Really good. Give me the purple. Okay. Ah, uh, I'm familiar with you. Doesn't mean I'm any less terrified of dying. Did that man just delay his projectile? Oh my god, that could have been the death of me. Speaking of the death of me, I'm just gonna heal. Cause that seems like the smart thing to do. Hello. Elite caster. No, sir, you're not supposed to be able to teleport. Okay. Rune! Unknown artifact. 
Spider rune. This permanent rune lets you cling to walls. Yes! Oh, I can run up walls a little bit. Oh, I really am a ninja now. <laughs> Ooh. Activate. Did that undo all of the blue? Or all of the yellow walls? Everything's orange now. I honestly would have preferred it stayed blue because that's much more calming. But, uh... No, this is cool. Research notebook. Some say the sap that runs through the walls is flowing into the sewer network and causing the malice. But perhaps the problem can also be the solution? Alright, this is nothing. Looks like I have to go back uh, through the teleporter thing. Here we go. That's that's a that's a long way back to go. Oh my God! Oh, we also woke up some uh, some more bad guys. That's super cool, actually. I like that. I like that a lot. Yeah, it did open those yellow doors, so now I can get anything hidden behind them. The good thing is now, though, that these are a lot of familiar enemies, so I'm not gonna die a whole lot. Alright, free item. Nope. Not a fair trade-off. Well, no, that is a fair trade-off. I'm not going to take that 300% damage increase just because I take 300% damage. Now, if I was comfortable and confident, oh my god, you look amazing. Can I copy your design for a Dungeons and Dragons campaign? That guy killed me in two punches! That guy killed me in two punches! Oh my gosh! Okay. Ah, uh, we got the wall jump now, so we can go to Slumbering Sanctuary on a regular basis. Uh oh my gosh. That that was that was really cool. I'm not gonna start another one. I'll start another video. I'll, I'll do another video. I'm going to end this one here. So, uh, thank you guys for coming out and watching this. Uh, go ahead and leave a like and subscription. They really help these videos out. Videos a ton. They don't help my English uh, very much. But I'll see you guys in the next video.